up hit. Ah! Oh my! Maybe that's where we need to go. I couldn't even see him. <laughs> Stop it, James. Stop it. Oh, God, I've hit a bump. Oh no, don't stand up! Whoa! Whoa! What the? Oh my god! Why would you make that sound? Let's freaking go. Man, you live for that shit, dude. You live for that shit. No, we're not far. What is up? Welcome to ACC on PlayStation. Yes. Look. PlayStation 4 Pro. Now obviously everyone and their mother who plays this game plays this on PC. But unfortunately <laughs> We only have PlayStation, so that's what we're on. We're here to see if it's any good. Uh, Colin, how you doing? Uh, we're gonna go with the with the big boy Bentley. I did a couple of laps last night, so should be, you know, able to not die as much. Right, what are we doing here? Hmm, let's have a look at these lobbies. Chill Racing down there. Fun Racing League. Zolder. The practice they. We want something that's quick and then quick. Mount Panorama. No. Pony Club. Qualifying one. Race. Qualifying two. Race. That's around Mount Panorama as well. Jesus. They want us to die. Gentlemen's Club. I think further down. Four out of ten, zero. I think that's it. And this is just pre ordered the GDDD Pro Wheel for you. Wow. You have got a you have got a keeper there. No, that's not that's not what I said. There we go. I clicked on it. And connect. Server is full. What? Son of a bitch. <laughs> I wish this was easier to navigate. Jesus Mary. Enduro Sport. 
five minute qualifying, ten minute race. It's a little bit short. Ten minute qualifying, fifteen minute race. Around Monza. Hmm. Don't really want to drive around Monza, do we? Sponsored by Coach Dave Academy. That's pretty cool. Five minutes practice, ten minutes qualifying, twenty minute race. I don't hate that. I don't hate that. Let's give it a go, shall we? That's what comes out to like thirty-five minutes. Right, now we got a. Oh my god! Green light. Go go go! Now we got to tweak this boy. What's up, Tigger? Okay. Smokey, what's up? Do I even go to bed? No. How dare you ask me that? Don't really know anything else. So, please tell me if um, if it's too loud, okay? Zolder, I've not driven for a long time. Oh, there's the white line, sorry. Don't tell Arden. How did it go last night? I did one race at Spa. Was it, it turned out to be like six laps around. Not too loud, thank you, Tony. Uh, I led for all six laps and then turned one on the last lap. Second place spun me. Just cool, isn't it? Ouch, I know. Currently we are first, because there's only us in this lobby. What's a uh, fairly decent... lap time for Zolder? Jeff. I'm not going to be doing the Manu tomorrow. 
No, I'm gonna go see Dylan tomorrow. Tire pressures look okay. On the front, anyway. The rears look a little bit low. That would definitely be more important, I know. For certain. Someone else would join this lobby. But it's a school that is sponsored by Coach Dave. It's just no one's playing this game, unfortunately. Right. Qualifying. Let's have a little tweaky tweak here. And of course, it doesn't tell me my previous stuff. Okay. These need to come up a little bit. Not really sure what it was on. Have a look at that. Ray, good morning. At least we'll get an easy win. Exactly. Exactly. Well, I should have taken fuel out, I guess. Whatever. Ignore that chat. Basic Ollie in the building. Join the dark side. I I wish I could join the dark side. I played this when it first came out on um, console, and it was obviously. Absolute tosh. And watching you play it the other day. Um, made me want to play it even more. But as you can see, by me being the only one in the lobby... The game is dead. The game is dead. I'll do the qualifying. Has console got the 1.8? Update. What is in that update? What's up, Siren? Finish this lab and then we'll go find another lobby. The 
did you have fun racing in uh, the same lobby as Jimmy Broadbent the other day, Ollie? Or yesterday, maybe? I continually find myself feeling limited with our new PlayStation. Hopefully it might pick up on console in February with the PS5 launch. But then you ask the question, will PS5s be able to play with PS4 players? That might be a big old no. How many players? There's 71 players playing this game right now. 71. I want to join this one, guys. You're not going to let me. You son of a bitch. Competitions of it? Nope. Not for another six hours. Nine out of sixteen. That's such a long... Why do you have thirty minutes practice? Whatever. There's people in here. I know. I feel like this could be a very frustrating stream. Whatever reason, ACC hurts my shoulders more. Okay. Let's do this thing. I'm just going off what we did last time. We're obviously just in free prank. No? I mean, I don't even know. I put here. Can't help but feel this game should never have been released on this gen. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Come on then, Boatly. That was the new BMW in the pits there, wasn't it? Yeah, you see him in number... 8 there. There we go, that's how you're supposed to <laughs> exit the pit properly. Says guessing. TMK, how you doing? Slow car ahead. Slow car ahead. It's not very nice. Saw that coming a mile off, didn't we? Yeah, you could argue that, Ollie. Yellow flag in sector one. So they pr probably still made a killing off of this game, didn't they? What's up, Adam? Adam says, for those of us who can't afford a decent PC, this is all we have. Yeah. And the thing is, the ACC, the... Um, the 
development team isn't that big, I think. I think they're relatively small as teams go. Oh, God. Those, like, screen shutters. Oh, my God. They're awful, aren't they? Thirteen people in here, though. This is almost too crowded. <laughs> Matthew Ray, how you doing, man? Nice to see you. I was too busy going through my map in there. Wasn't actually paying attention to driving. We are two tenths off the P1. This is free practice, so it doesn't really matter. But it's nice to uh, know you can beat the people you're about to race. Literally game changing, or oh, I can only imagine, Betty. And you got your PS5 last week. I don't think I could be more jealous. Catch a layer, Smokey. <laughs> Scary guy. How you doing, Kenneth? Good Friday to you. Slidey going in there. Tire pressures are a little bit high. Mm. They're actually all right, aren't they? dead. <laughs> Yellow flag is Two mirrors. See that PD? I know. You can turn the virtual mirror off as well. Unbelievable. God, we love a slide today, don't we? Love a slide.
not as fast through there. I suppose we've got to tweak around with some... Suspension stuff if we want to ride the curves a little bit better. I'm not too privy to that stuff, so... Not the best hairpin. <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> That's a little faster. a little bit more right now. It's a bit scary. Definitely faster through there. Happy to see me on ACC. Probably won't happen again. This is just a sort of a tester. The only thing that you can really do on here is league race. Oh, I lost a bit of traction out there. Actually, when I go into the pits, but there's a guy behind me. He sees that and he goes past. There we go. Okay, so Adam's in. Adam is an exceptionally fast person. Paddy says, I want to give this go uh, game another go, but I really d dislike the setup stuff. It just bothers me that you have to do that. I hope GT7 stays like GT Sport in that regard. I think, yeah, I think it's I think it's a learning curve, isn't it? As soon as you know, like, what to do, like, I know that we need to, like, do this. Like, <laughs> Level 1 is tire pressures. Level 2, fuel. Level 3, aero. Level 4, mechanical grip. I'd like to see um, some... Do some fast laps, I'd like to see some one make lobbies as well. I think that would be pretty cool. Definitely. Right. L U underscore R eight eight. Where are they? Number eighty eight. They're coming around. Adam's out now as well. Coming into the final corner. Him and number twelve. Number twelve's Richie, so they should be going quite fast. Might be getting some slipstream off of Richie if that's the thing in this game. Coming across the line. That person does improve their lap time. Is a 130.6 a fairly decent lap time? Chatterini. 
Is it a fairly decent lap time? Adam just died. He just died. I saw him die on the map. You think he crashed with number 70. I enjoy watching you guys as much as racing myself, so I'll just let you do the brain stuff. No, no, no. Better rate. This is where you all do the brain stuff and tell me what to do. That's how this works. That's how this works. Guys, we've got a full lobby. A full lobby. Can you believe it? Been sitting in the pits for a long time. Our tyres are very cold. <laughs> Got the wrong view with me then. Okay, not everyone has to. Oh, that's a cold tire right there. Wanted to turn in. No. That corner feels really nice when you go through it nicely. So who is watching the World Finals this weekend? The Gran Turismo Sport World Finals. Is it a live event or is it... And what I mean by that, is it a live in-person event? Or is it... A live virtual one. I'm assuming it'll be a live slash virtual. What's up, Sean? Happy Friday, Squire. Pre recorded. Shorts here! Shorts here! <laughs> yeah, you're right there, Batty, right? seems to be a lot of drama that places like or communities like first person sure gosh shooters have you know they're always pre-recorded they can edit out the penalties can't they then Salty boy. What's up, beer can? How did race A go last night? We did 20 minutes practice of race A, and then... Oh gosh, what's the apex that? Did 20 minutes practice, did one race, and we won the race. Done. Ooh, 
Well, that guy went faster than us. I will say that Gran Turismo Sports social media stuff has got a lot better recently. Dylan is doing well. She's out of the hospital. She's back with her parents. Oh gosh. I get to see her tomorrow. What is Gran Turismo? What is sportsmanship? Hopefully we won't have any damage from that. No, in my luck, we will. Gotta figure out how much fuel we need for this race. And I'm looking at you, chat. What did it say? A 15 minute race? Will do, Sean. Don't really want to be as close to this guy. As this, but I'm here. And it looks like we're only going to get one lap in. Fuel usage says Australian in here. Oh man, and then, oh, then we got spun ourselves. <laughs> oh, well, who was it? Number 70 was in front of us. And Tunis Maro. And then we got a little tap from Adam. Just because we were... We obviously had tapped into the... Back of the McLaren. 25 litres should be good. Yeah, 2.4. per lap. 29 litres. Twenty five should be good. What if we get round the extra lap though? I don't know if that happens. Batty Ray, catch you later, man. Thanks for popping in. The jewels at two point six. 
How about I meet in the middle? I'll go 27. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. We'll go we'll go with Ollie. We'll go 29. Well, it looks like we're going to start from the back anyway, so it should be some fun. Who's crashed? Number 14. Number 14 is number 7. Vortex driver in here. He is coming around the last corner now. I'm also slow though, Sean. If not slower than Ollie. Right, he's on his last lap now. Coming through is number 720. That is possible. In the McLaren, followed by number 44 in the Nissan, 720, not seven lap time, 44, then 80. 44 is done, 80 is done, he improves. Minute and a half to the race. We just gotta stay away from the madness. Roadblock Ron, what a name. Thirty point two, that's a decent lap time. It's pretty decent. Still out there. Diego, how you doing? Here we go, it's race time. Thank you, Jeff. If I'm going to play this more, join League Public Lobbies. I know. I don't think I will, though. To be honest. I was just, um... <laughs> Kurt, how you doing? No dailies today, no. Um, I just wanted to test out ACC, to be honest. What's up, feel the vibes? I'm on PS4 Pro. PS4 Pro. Vastec. What? Thirty seconds. Thirty seconds. Thirty seconds. I guess you've also got to a, a, a camp from here to the line as well with your fuel, right? Okay, I see Adam there in 11th in front of us. Good luck, have fun. Don't die. Don't die. Audi's scaring me. Still alive. I think Adam's to our left here. 
Light damage on the rear, guys. Out of turn two. Car on the right. Clear on the right. Yellow flag ahead. Be careful. Jeez Louise. Not dead though. Car on the left. Clear on the left. Not dead. <laughs> oh. Interesting strategy from the driver in front there. The madness. The madness. So what does rear damage do? Does that make my rear um, more slidey or does it make me understeer more? Anybody know? Just so I know what to look out for. My rear does feel a little bit loose. <laughs> First time you've seen ACC in ages. God, don't tell Ollie that he's been playing it for the last two days. Less rear down for us. Yeah, that booty's gonna be. Car on the right. Clear on the right. That booty's gonna be a little bit wobbly. Personal best on lap three, perfect. Let's continue to chip off that time. Like the game itself runs okay, doesn't it? It's not perfect by any means. Slow down to a crawl for a second there, Adam. Yellow flag, yellow flag, be careful. Slow car ahead. I believe you meant to say incredibly slow car. On track overtake. Pico, how you doing? Joe Scott as well, nice to see you. Got a little bit slidey there. He is no good on console as you're Car on the left. As you're seeing today. Jeez Louise.
when the PS5 update comes, should be amazing. I mean, yes, that will fix a lot of problems for people on PlayStation 5. <laughs> will it fix problems for people? Oh, there nearly. On PlayStation 4, though. Or should we just accept that it's never going to be as good on PS4? I'll tell you what, my rear end is exceptionally loose. We just got monched by the uh, Mercedes behind us. PS4, who cares? <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, I think that's the... That's the way it's going. Faster than this Lexus. Hello, full of sexual innuendos today. I'd love to. Yeah, Joe. Like, there's just there's a lot of features from. Oh man. He put me off a little bit there. Thanks for not rejoining like a madman. There's a lot of features that iRacing and ACC have on on PC that obviously we don't get on on console. And the features is the experience as well. Arkies, how you doing? Catch this Nissan in front of us. Slow through there. Jesus, a bird just flew into a window in front of me. A bit distracted by that, unfortunately. <laughs> Literally, a bird flew into the window. <laughs> oh, struggling to reach out. Oh, gosh, yes, yes. Oh, that must look gross. I'll sort that out after this race, guys. Sorry about that. I mean, do we even need chat up? anymore. The only reason the only reason I had it up before is because we were multi-streaming on Facebook and YouTube and it was a way for you guys to see you know what the other guys on the other platform are saying but now it's only on YouTube I don't think we need it. Lexus is turning the screw. Yellow flag is at all. Car on the left. Clear on the left. 
left. Yeah, I was gonna say, is it clear on the left? Fast ginger. What is that? He died? Who died? Ooh. The cockpit is so intense. Yes, yeah, the slight shake to everything, isn't it? Adam. I'm sorry, dude. Got some light on the front of the like, are you paying attention to the race at all, fella? Is it, was he paying attention at all? I made sure to not move. Oh, I wouldn't get smashed in. Okay, we do have front damage and rear damage now. So does that equal out? Oh, no. Now there's a world of hurt. We got big understeer now. ACC lost you week one, Greddy. Oh, I was parked on his racing line. Oh, okay. Sorry. How selfish of me. How selfish. I'll tell you what. Should we just play some Gran Turismo Sport? Should we just go crazy on on race B? I think that might be the plan. Bye ACC. It was a good effort. It was a good effort. It was a good effort, right? I've got to change change the stream name and stuff. It was a good effort. Can I change it? This is the question. Yes, I can. Gran Turismo Sport. Day three races. There we go. Changed. Updated. Ooh, two minutes before race B as well. It's like I timed it perfectly. Where are you? Monsieur McLaren. There it is. Ooh. There we go, change my settings. Perfect. Oh, removing chat. I mean, it should be okay now, right? What do you think? Ah, uh, you know what, man? I'm gonna remove it. I'm gonna remove. I think I did well for as, as long as I did. Yeah, I think so too. That was freaking brutal, wasn't it? Okay, so let's, let's answer the question of, is ACC on console dead? Yes. Yes, it is still dead. Sad to see the quality of driving 
on ACC PS4. I, I mean, the, I I had a couple of good moments with some people, but then just that guy didn't like slow down. I was literally still. There was nothing I could have done. Oh, dear me. Oh, he was helping me face the right way. Oh, God. Gustavo, how you doing? What happened? The, the game is just... Not dead. There was only 71 people playing it. In the world. On PlayStation. 71 people. I think if their com competition server and their like competitive ranking worked out of the gates, I think I think they could have been on for something. I think they could have had a really good thing. But the issue is with the game itself, apart from your own stats that you're raising, like your consistency and your whatever. Um, what else is there to do? There's no daily races. There's no competition. The only thing that you can do is league races. And if you don't have time, like me, this is when I can play the game. I can't play the game. Um, uh, I can't play the game in league racing settings because there's no leagues right now, is there? Um... But whatever. If GT Sport goes dead, which game would you consider next? <sighs> if GT Sport died, I would stop creating content. <laughs> I would just stop. Oh, 71 on in public lobbies. Yeah, I think I'd have a lot of fun. I would obviously have a lot of fun in, in League stuff. Oh man, look at our signal. We need to actually practice coming from one game to another. It's not good, is it? It's so smooth, this game. I think the game will be a little bit quiet now as well. Let me do that. Da, 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 da. So I turned it turned it down yesterday for ACC. Okay, guys, we're back to Gran Turismo Sport. <laughs> It's what we do. We pivot. We pivot. The user friendliness of GCS is unmatched. Hey, we're on Grand Christmas Sport uh, Positivity Month. So, you know. Exactly, Gustavo. There's not a lot of trust. Yes, Adam. I'm with you in that in that respect. <sighs> I know I'm so torn between getting a PC and a or a PlayStation Five. PlayStation Five means I'll be able to play the games that I want to over the next couple of months. God of War, Horizon, blah 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 blah. Um. But then I can't play more racing games. Amazing Gustavo. Love that. The poor Mercedes. Uh. 
No room in the inn. No room in the inn. Can't see anything. <laughs> Has anyone got penalties? No is the answer. Mercedes. <laughs> Pulling no punches there. Uh, not last. <laughs> not last. Any hobbies outside of YouTube for myself? Um, I'm learning Spanish. <laughs> if that counts. Lots of contact behind. Got to give him space on the inside there. Hope he doesn't run us into the wall. Which he does, because he's an absolute jerk. No one on his left at all. What a jerk. Um, but other than that, I like... Movies. I love a good movie. And I coach, uh, like, my full time job is coaching football or soccer, depending on where you're from. Youth, youth soccer, youth football. Oh my god, what are you doing? What just happened? Man, I tell you what. If there was ever a day that is trying to make me not play this game or to race at all, this is it, right? I'd like to apologise on behalf of the whole of Danish Gran Turismo. Thank you, I appreciate that. God, the pace in this race is absolutely rapid. I don't think it was a brake check. I think it was... It, it looked like he crashed into that wall. Oh, he did. Oh my god, dude. You know what? I would have felt bad, but he was the guy that we went into back of, I think. I have no idea. They all look the same. Karma! <laughs> Lady Karma reared its head. Being a football coach sounds fun. What you got? What got you into it? Um, it was the sport that I played growing up, and then when I was 21, I coached my my brother's under 16 uh, boys team, obviously.
when on the slipstream. That's damaging. Uh, and then I came to America. So I'm in America right now. And uh, came to America in 2012 and then been back and forth and managed to bag myself a wonderful American lady. I got married to this year and just a very, very lucky to be out here basically. Sweep past him there. Man, if we can get a top 10 from this, this would be incredible. Just missed the changeover. ACC has changed. Ooh, we got a 1.5 second penalty. A three second penalty. Three seconds. Oh, that's unbelievable. And it's getting chippy up there as well. Oh, the drums. Don't you be squeezing me, sucker. This Portuguese guy just absolutely destroyed the German. Wow, what a turd. So we could have had a fifth there, but because that Portuguese guy sent it, uh, we are not. We're having an eighth. Wow, guys. I don't think he was happy with me squeezing past. I don't think he was happy. N Nelson. Jeez Louise. It was the smoothest transition ever. <laughs> wow. Wow, wow. Bow. My goodness. My goodness. Nelson, what are you doing? How did we get a red S? That's what I mean. Like, we got a red S. Did we do anything bad in that race? I'm not sure we did. Nelson, idiot. You tell him. Nelson's saying something as well. Oh, he's decided, he decided against it and he left. <laughs> How do I find America? America's great. There's a... Uh, a lot of... It's just more my style, I think, of living. Food's good. Um, weather, weather is more seasonal. Your winters are cold. Your summers are hot. You know what I mean? Raven Bongus, congratulations. Didn't know you got married. Yes, we got married in May. Um, and then we're having our big ceremony, ceremony, wedding, whatever you want to call it, um, next August. We just wanted to get the green card process started so now I could get a proper work visa and, and actually earn money. This whole year I've been on a living stipend of not enough money, basically. It's been freaking brutal. So, believe me when I say channel donations, memberships, all that kind of stuff has literally put food on the table this year. So, thank you very much. I really appreciate you all. She married, yeah, she married me for money. Yeah, the $450 I get a week, that's what she married me for.
Where in the uh, US? I'm in Boston. So on the East Coast. Satan's front porch. Are you down in uh, Florida, Beer King? Red Sox State, exactly. Fun fact for those of you who don't know the owner of the Red Sox owns Liverpool as well. I have been to Arizona. I uh, lived and worked in Phoenix for about three weeks. Um, many years ago. I loved it. Went out there in the, in the spring. Weather was lovely. Damn it. Liverpool Homers. There you go, Neil. Beautiful city, Boston. Yeah, it's awesome. I mean, when I say hot summers in Boston, I mean hotter than England. Which isn't terribly difficult. A 56.8. Cambridge is nice. Yeah, I'm just in one of the surrounding... Uh, I don't know what you call them. I mean, I guess they're like they, I guess they're little towns themselves. So, like I'm in Brookline, which is next to Boston. A little bit hot into there. Suburbs. That's the wall. That's annoying. We were going quite fast there. Better exit. The time that is the time of year now that you get four seasons in one day. That's exactly right. It's like sunny right now, as you can tell by my illuminated face. Um, but it's like that cold sun. You know what I mean? Oh, the consistency is incredible. But guys, if you haven't already, go ahead, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't as well. Got a nice... Uh... A nice December of content coming your way. This Garantra is my sport positivity month. fast there as well. We've got a good mixture of videos, live streams, and YouTube shorts as well. Coming your way this month. Oh, 
I know we can be faster out here, so this is going to be nice if we get the last corner correct. Which we do. Positive, the penalty system sucks. Yeah, you tell them. You tell them. We're going to make it. We're going to make it. Nice. 56.2. I think we got 56. Well, I don't know what we've got on our American account. It might be a 56. Z zero. Oh, we're going to have the Santa versus the Elves thing. Like Thanksgiving? Yes. Yes, we are. So positive. I love that banner. I love that a lot. Yeah, Arkies, but Boston's great. It really is. Feel the vibes in 16th. I saw you in here earlier. Good luck. The Santa versus the Elves race. So when we did the turkey smash the other day. Should we call it the Santa smash? Maybe you use the Samba bus. Yeah, we could use that. I just feel that the, the the Ford and the um the Ford Raptor and the Minis are actually quite a good um balance. Or Santa versus Grinch, yes, Ray. Mark Thomas, good afternoon, sir. Happy Friday, everybody. Happy Friday to you. Right, if we can somehow manage to keep our position this race, I think that'll be fantastic. We're obviously in a lower S-rated lobby. Right? Or is just no one playing this today? There's only one A-plus driver in here. Oh. <laughs> I watched the replay from the last race. You are absolutely wrong in this game. <laughs> oh, the salt. The salt. <laughs> Run away. Run away is the call. Up my freaking toe. That hurt. Okay. There we go. There we go. Oh, it's on now. It's on now. Come on, Raul Lopez. Let's run away. Run away with me. Here we go. It's on like D -d -d Donkey Kong. Still early in the day, exactly. Gonna go for probably another hour. Oh dear. Not sure the uh, German remembered where his brake pedal was there. I think it was German. It's 
guy's all over the place. Um, how has he not got a penalty yet? He has hit every single wall. That is mental. It's got to be something to do with lag, isn't it? Like it's showing him hitting the walls on my screen, but he's not actually hitting the walls. The Battle of the Three Bar Signal Boys. Run, boyo. Run with your one bar signal. Run with your one bar. <laughs> I think this is a different German. Filling me with fantastic confidence, this guy in front. Oh, I could not have been closer to getting a penalty there. Jesus. Kind of nailed that there. That was nice. I said he looked sketchy. He's going to save that penalty. guys. Run. Our chance to escape. Now they're going to push each other. Hopefully not. Hopefully for them they'll, they'll try and work together but I'm seeing two by two back there so the gap is coming down. It's come down a tenth. Come down two tenths. Maybe three tenths by here. There's barrels everywhere. We have escaped. We have escaped. Run away. I don't hit the walls exactly. We sure are flirting with them, though, aren't we? Haven't quite mastered the consistency of that last corner yet. faster. One lap more, guys. One lap more. I 
56.6. Exactly three tenths faster. Playground, how you doing? Louise James. Oh dear. I've got progressively worse at that corner each lap. A's B London, thank you very much. Thank you for liking. Kind of nice. Nice and safe to the finish. We got a win. Kind of want to do a race. See this morning. I think we'll do, do we'll do two more race B's and then we'll do a race race C. Doctor Woody boy, hey hey, how we doing? Man, I've had so many different names of my channel. Reckon we had adventure. James Adventum for a little bit. That's Latin for adventure. We got it, boys. We got it. Goodness gracious me. <sighs> I remember the days of a hundred plus viewers, two hundred viewers. What has changed, guys? Let's have a let's have a chat about it right now. Let's get into it. Why do you think why do you think that we're not we're not streaming as big as we have been in the past? Why do we think? Hmm. I think I had a pretty Oh gosh, that's sharp. I had a pretty on and off um, summer, I think. I think we had a really good May. I think it was May this year that was our biggest biggest month of this year was May. And then I just couldn't do it anymore. And I had to work a lot more. I had to study a lot more. And the live streams kind of dried up basically consistency in times you're streaming yeah like right now it's a little bit a little bit um, early isn't it even now is a little bit early 
Lockdown ended, noticed it with a lot of streaming figures. Yeah, I think so. Time of day, perhaps. It's the networking of YouTube has changed. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping that December does good for us. Oh, it does good. I hope that December is good. Uh, I'm just going to stream as much as I can. Obviously, Dylan being away for next week as well. I'm going to try and stream as much as possible. Um, I live in a real world. Can't be on 24-7 like some people. I know. People aren't working from home anymore all the time, exactly. So, you know, the, the best time to stream is like evening time for EMEA, right? Or Europe, let's just say, evening time for Europe. And evening time for Europe is when I leave for work here. <laughs> Which is obviously frustrating. Think numbers will boost when GT7 drops? Possibly. I mean, definitely. New game. It's going to be the talk of the town, isn't it? I just, I just hope I'm still doing this when GT7 drops. I said to myself, and I'll let you in on this as well. I said, uh, December is my quote unquote. Is it quote unquote or quote unquote? December is my um, uh, make or break month, basically. I'm going to do it as much as possible, put all of my energy in it over December. If I see really good numbers and uh, like predicted growth, then I'll continue with it. If I don't, I think I'm going to take a step back. January. Maybe only do it once a week. Do I enjoy doing this? I love doing this. I love it. GTS a little long in the tooth. Mm -hmm. You have a lot of European followers on this channel. And the time you stream, a lot of us are still at work. Yeah. You'll be doing this. You know you will. Always draws you back, does GT. No, I think... So, like, with anything, right? With anything, you... We only have a certain amount of hours in a day. I'm in a really weird spot in my life where I don't really know what I want to do. I'm, re I'm quite good at coaching, but, like, I'm just getting by being good at coaching just because I'm personable and, and I know enough about soccer and you know I've studied leadership and coaching and stuff so I'm like just getting by on that kind of stuff if I put every second of every day you know into that into that stuff I think I could be a really freaking good coach this isn't your full time money maker James no I know and it's, it's been so difficult for me this whole year because I haven't been getting paid regularly at my job. You know, I've been doing 20, 30, 40 hours a week coaching soccer, let's just say, in a, in a broad sense, but not getting paid for 40 hours. Like, there's some weeks that I did the hourly rate, I get six, like $6 an hour. The minimum, the minimum um, hourly rate in America is fifteen. My master's is in leadership in sport, so like it's been a real like, and this has been the only other way I could make money this year. So, when I get my work visa, like in the early months of twenty twenty two, I can literally do whatever I want, and and hopefully actually make some money because it's been really freaking difficult I own with a university staff or a private club a uh, private club like a club soccer team or a club soccer club 
So it's just been a very interesting year. It's been a lot of on and off, positive and negative and up and down with sweeps of sadness and stuff like that, so. Times I've been away for a month, still here with her. I know, Sean, but there's a there's a real big difference when we leave and we're streaming to like 150 people and then I take a break and I come back and it's, well, whatever it is right now. The loyalty is fantastic and I can never, que never question that, but if we're talking about longevity and actually doing it for a living, uh, 35 but streaming to like 30 to 50 people isn't isn't good enough is it in terms of you know actually doing it as a job doing it for fun and to all that stuff is is great you know and if we did it once a week we might do like the monday monday races every week and that's our stream you know what i mean Raving bonkers coming in with the 20 says buy yourself a pizza young man dude i was gonna get pizza tonight don't tell dylan don't tell dylan but i'm gonna get pizza tonight definitely gonna get pizza now can we show some love to raving bonkers in the chat with the massive 20 english queen heads raven thank you very much man it's incredibly generous you didn't have to do that but I will. I will. I will buy some pizza. Broken Cornetto. That's a great name. Okay. Let's win this race, shall we? Now what's funny as well is... Um, since I've been playing more, i played a lot more on the wheel over the last couple of weeks. I've actually got a lot better. Do I do private soccer sessions? Yes. And I think I charge $60 an hour for that. Thank you, Broken. Um. <clears throat> but I just go, that, that money goes to my company. It doesn't go to me. I get 10% of that, so. I'm too far into my coaching to think about this. Think too much about this. Thank you, Sean. I appreciate you, brother. I appreciate you. Okay. Heads on. We had our little moment. We had our moment. Let's get it going. I know. I've always just wondered, like, what if I had the time like Key does. You know what I mean? Like, Ollie has a full-time job as well, I think. And looking at... Um, looking at this, their numbers, because both Key and Ollie uploaded their... like a picture of their views and watch time hours like they're on the same thing like they basically have the same watch time the same views oh legend thank you German man that with my own travel, my own club. I mean, I do drive an hour to work each day. That doesn't help with my streaming. If I lived 20 minutes away, I'd be able to stream like two or three. And then just drive to work. But I have to leave at like 1.30 because of the traffic. Hold it.
Class exit. Good morning, Evil Melon. How you doing? Yeah, Sean, it is not an easy job. I will say that. You, and you know what the hardest thing is about my job? is the parents. Parents suck sometimes, dude. So I have under 11 boys team. These kids are 10 years old. I have 16 players on my squad. They play 9v9, so there's seven subs. I think that's too much, obviously. Um, but uh, so, so they're ten years old. It's about development. It's not about winning games. So I have to. I play everyone like half. It, I, it's a 50% thing. Everyone gets the same amount of playing time. The best players and the worst players. They're 10 years old. Winning literally doesn't matter. They they are they forget about it 20 minutes later. They're kids. And one parent just took his player and went to another went to another club. Oh gosh. Because he wasn't getting enough game time. And you've got to think, they play eight games a season. So they played eight games, let's say, this full season. And... So instead of playing, they played 30 minutes. Their games are 60 minutes long. They played 30 minutes minimum. And he was one of the better players, so he played a little bit longer. Because sometimes I just I would leave him in there because he's being solid. But um, because he wasn't getting enough game time, what's the difference between having playing thirty minutes or forty minutes on a weekend? Your player's not going to become the next Messi by playing ten minutes more each game. It's not. Yes, appreciate you, German. like to leave leave halfway through a season and leaving your teammates what kind of lesson is that teaching the kid as well they pay like two grand a year as well to be on this team the money is ridiculous close oh gosh yeah two grand plus the kits plus going and staying in hotels for tournament weekends it's freaking wild man Power too early there. They've got to play the long ball game. Yes. Yes. Punt. 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 Yeah, parents are crazy, man. Parents are crazy. I'm like saying to them, I'm like, dude, your, your kid is the worst kid out of, the most disruptive kid out of all of my players and like the amount of like work I've done with him 
Like, he has really bad ADHD as well, so he, like, doesn't pay attention. But no, go sit on the bench for another team. It literally doesn't matter. Whatever you want. <laughs> Whatever you want. The coach that had these boys last year was a bit of an ass, and he made, like, there was, there's 11 players that were on the team previously, and then I brought five players with me, because I had the team below the year before. And these 10, like, most of these kids are, like, little arrogant kids. Because when they were under 10, they played up. They played at under 11. But they played in the worst bracket of under 11, so they weren't playing against good kids. This year, we're playing in, like, the second highest division for U11s. Sorry, I just try to do a little bit of a shake up there so I could get behind him so I could win the race. But yeah, they're just arrogant, dude. Trying to make kids not idiots. Get wrecked, Mike. <sighs> um, you know, it's just... It's just crazy. Parents are crazy, kids are crazy. Can't coach parents like that, is the thing. Parrot's Playground coming in with the 20 Aussie dollars. He says grab a six pack to go with the pizza while the cat's away. James eats pizza and beer. <laughs> Sleep time for me. Parrot, thank you so much, man. That's incredibly generous. You have a wonderful sleep yourself. If we can, throw some love at Parrot in the chat, please, for that amazing donation to the channel. Well done. Uh, between Raven Bonkers and uh, Parrot's Playground today, you've basically made my daily wage. So thank you very much. <laughs> Appreciate you. Um, I will say as well, like, why is no one... What, what, why is no one commenting about that amazing move I just did there? Like, what? Guys. What about that amazing move? I think I'm going to leave it there for today, actually. I really need a wee. I need to get ready for work. <laughs> I swear. I need to get ready for work. But it's been good chatting with you guys. You always make me feel really good. Um, so that's gonna be it. Beer can chicken seventy seven coming in with the five US dollars. Tip the driver. Amazing. Feel the vibes this week's days have royally rogered your driver rain at SRA and it's not an easy week. It's not an easy week, man. Thank you, Sean. Um, yes, I'll pass on my love to Dylan. Thank you for the kind words for her. She's uh, She did give me a little smile. A little medicated smile when I told her that the nerds said hello and they're wishing you well. Um, but that's going to be it. Um, Friday. Oh, Friday. I'm going to make some videos tonight. I'm going to get a pizza. I'm going to get some beers. And I'm going to make some videos tonight. That's what I'm going to do. And that's going to be it. Thank you so much for watching, liking, subscribing, and supporting me and my channel, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Oh, God, I've hit a bump. Oh, no, don't stand up. Whoa, whoa, what the, oh, my God.